Welcome to Aster CMI Hospital, where the world comes for international healthcare solutions. I'm here to talk on breast cancer as this is a breast cancer awareness week. Breast cancer develops in breast tissue and it's a number one killer disease in women affecting almost 12% of the women worldwide. Now, the signs and symptoms of breast cancer are mainly feeling a lump in the breast, change in size and the breast or enlargement of the breast, constant pain in the breast, dimpling of the skin or any fluid which is coming out from the nipple or if there is any bone pain, any shortness of breath which suggests that there is a spread of this cancer. The risk factors mainly include being a female itself is a risk factor for breast cancer as the incidence is higher as compared to the men. Second is the obesity. As obesity is on the rise, therefore it's one of the major risk factors for breast cancer. Women who menstruate at an early age and also has late menopause or women who have no children and or have late children at a later age are at increased risk. Women who are diabetic or women who are on hormone replacement therapy as a treatment for menopause or who are taking the oral contraceptive pills for more than 10 years of age uh, or nearly 10 years. These are all the risk factors which are mainly the concern for causing the breast cancer. The treatment or the diagnosis is done mainly by self-examination or clinical examination or by ultrasound or mammography or there are higher modalities like MRI or CT scan or an FNSC which is done or, and the histopathology will prove that it is a cancer. The cancer depends on uh, treatment depends on the staging of the disease and it is dealt by the breast oncosurgeon mainly in the cancer center. And Coming to the prevention now is the prevention is mainly depends on the screening of the women and it is beneficial in women about the age of between 40 to 70 years of age and therefore uh, the mammography or an ultrasound scan is recommended every two years to rule out at women who are at increased risk of breast cancer.